Hello there, my name is Ismail. Welcome to Blender 2.8 training series. This is going to be a series of video tutorials on my YouTube channel explaining how Blender works and how you can use it. Uh, so we're going to be using specifically Blender 2.8, but uh, the principles we're going to be looking at can be applied to any version of Blender, that is uh, Blender 2.7 and below or anything after released after Blender 2.8. And uh, some of the part, some of the things we're going to be looking at here can be also applied in any version of any 3D application like 3D Max, uh, Maya, Cinema 4D, Houdini, or any application you want to use. Uh, because any 3D application that has ever been made or that will be made, uh, they all uh, are built on top of these, are built on the same principles of the 3d world uh, so they all use vertices they all use edges they all use faces uh, they just customize uh, those principles uh, and use custom uh, tools menus user interface uh, yeah but uh, the core principles are always the same so let's get started so what i'm going to be doing is i'm going to attempt to uh, release at least four tutorials per day uh, explaining how blender works and uh, i'll be releasing them around morning time uh afternoon evening and uh, maybe in the midnight so that wherever you are you can at least uh see a video published a training tutorial published when you are awake uh yes yeah. so let's get started by downloading blender uh, so to download blender you need to go to blender.org let me open this so just go to this URL and then you can see by the time I'm recording this video, I'm recording this video, uh, Blender 2.8 is still in beta form, uh, but uh, it's very stable right now. Not completely stable, it still crashes a few times, but uh, I think most of the changes have been confirmed. They're not going to change the interface more than, they, more than it is right now. Uh, so most of the changes have been locked in. Uh, they're just fixing, fixing a few bugs and uh, yeah but uh let's get started so to download blender 2.8 you just need to click download here i uh, can see it says 2.7 but uh it will give you this screen where you can uh, download uh blender 2.8 uh beta which we're going to be using so you just click on that and uh, it will start downloading the application it will uh, as of the re as of recording this uh video you don't get an exe file uh, that has already been compiled into an executable file uh, you get a zip file uh, like let me find it uh, like this so what you do you just uh, right click and uh, you should find an option if you're using uh, Windows you should find an, op an option that says unzip or extract files uh, if you're using WinRAR if you have the WinRAR uh, application installs uh, you can just hit extract files here and uh, you will have all the files uh, extracted like this so you, there is no installation file it's just a zip file that you extract and then you can open blender by just clicking on the icon here and you're done you can just give it a second to load and uh, this is how it will look for you uh, yes yeah, so but uh, after is in uh, alpha mode i think they will release an installation uh file uh, that you can just click uh continue 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 and then it uh, installs uh, the application as any applic uh, application works uh, but uh, yeah so that's how you download blender uh that's where you get blender uh, so after downloading after downloading it this is how the interface will look if you want to get back the splash screen you just go under help and then click splash screen to load to, to load this uh, splash splash screen yeah so this is i think part one i uh, just introducing the training series so in part two uh, we're going to be looking at uh, the general interface and how it has changed uh, from the previous versions of blender thank you